all right so attention guys um this is coded m2o if it's your first time you know coming to my channel um that is coded and i'm the owner of Silco imports i'm also a shipping agent um, i do procuring you know for people who want me to procure from one associated for them and then one of the key things that i also do is that i do mini importation you know classes and my class is very very unprecedented it is a lifetime mentorship coaching that I'll coach you throughout, you know, your lifetime as you are with me. And I'll be going more into it at the end of the video. Um, today, um, I'm, I want to address this issue that is, you know, going on in the business, in the importation business. Uh, uh, recently, there has been a rampant increase in the rates per CBM of uh, goods and uh, shipping fee. Uh, most businesses cannot you know, really afford it and they don't know whether if they should continue with the business or not but then um, some of them also think that it is just um, a way of taking them out of business and some of them think that is the shipping agency that just want to chop their money or make money out of it but there are real things going on underground and I want to uh, reveal it or give clarity to or uh, uh, my students and also uh, my clients who want to do business with me now if this is your first time coming to my channel um, please do the honor of subscribing and then liking the page and also sharing it to anyone that is concerned or bothered or worried um, and based on how things are going now okay so let's talk about what is happening um, in the business now uh, re recently there has been some rampant increase in the um, fees that they charge per CBM and uh, <laughs> it is so amazing it's so shocking to you, you you really don't know what's happening you wake up you sleep you wake up the next day and it's going on and as a shipping agent my clients always complain to me and I have to explain to them what is going on most shipping agency don't explain it or they don't tell you what is going on but as a mini importer or as a coach as a mentor I need to make my students, you know, um, know the reason that is going on. Now, the reason why the CBM is going higher and higher is because of what is happening on the Red Sea. Now, those of you who don't know the Red Sea, the Red Sea serves as a route that connects um, international trade between Europe, Asia, and Africa. And anyone that wants to do businesses among these countries, transporting or um, using um, this particular route will definitely face a challenge in this current situation that we are in. Um, aside the Red Sea being an, a, a route where international trade, you know, occurs, it is also a route that there is a lot of battleground, you know, going on between countries that I don't want to mention about in this particular video for the sake of security reasons. But then you can still search on it and then you will get more info on it. The, the countries and the terrorists that are you know causing this challenge and stuff so what is happening anytime goods are being transported within this route there are attacks on the containers some of them are targeted some of them are not targeted and you will never know which one is happening so these shipping companies you know those who are shipping their goods from china to africa asia to africa europe to anywhere using this route have to encounter this challenge uh, so they are being attacked every day so what these shipping companies are doing now is to find a strategy out and in finding new strategy um, well, that is how come uh, the, the cost is coming in now the red sea is the shortest route when these three continents want to you know do business or trade among themselves the red sea is the shortest route and is the most cost effective the other alternative is long, that is if assuming they want to use the um, southmost African you know, route, that it means that they are going to incur more costs because that place is very long. Uh -huh. So that is the alternative to the Red Sea. So since the Red Sea is having the challenge that terrorists are attacking the cargo and shippers don't know what to do and they have to strategize because you will not want your goods to sink in the sea and not come so they have to strategize and in their strategy that is how come the cost you know comes in um, when they use the long route then it means that they are going to incur more energy 
before the goods comes to your destination. That is, if they use the southmost part uh, of African continent, then it means that they are going to incur more energy. And once they are going to incur more energy, it means that more cost. And more cost means that you, the customer or the client, will also have to suffer the consequences or pay more. And that is some of the reasons why um, the CBM rate is going higher. And also, there might also be the possibility or the probability that they are still using the Red Sea, but then once it is being attacked, you need to put down security measures to be able to protect yourself or protect your goods from the attack. One of the things to do um, is to ensure or have a comprehensive you know, insurance policy where your goods are protected and in case it is attacked, you'll be able to refund money to your customers. The another thing is that you put on a security measure where the security measure it means that you either have to negotiate for a free pass you know a free pass on the red sea or you put down um, some strong security measure that even when the attack happens you will be able to you know um, survive and your goals will have a free passage now these are the reason why the shipping fee is going higher it's going higher you wake up today and then it has been adjusted and you just have to do whatever means to also adjust yours and then let your customers also know about it now i came here to let you know the reasons these are the reasons so um, um it's something that we uh, the shipping companies have no control over once they have a control over it they will bring it down to you um if you are a newbie it, it, it might be your first time but if you have been in the business for long you know that some of these things do really happen assuming if you are a newbie, you never knew what happened during the COVID-19 time. During the COVID-19 time, the CBM, the rate per CBM, went as high as nearly $400 per CBM. And that one affected a lot of businesses and it nearly collapsed a lot. But then some were able to have their way and they still survived. So this one too, you have to just survive, you know, have your strategies in place. You know go back to the table have your strategies in place and then you'll be able to survive this one too so this philco imports or coded m2 here to address the issue on the hikes in the rate of the cbm so um if it is you find this information very knowledgeable and informative you know you can say it to your friends who are also in this business so that they will also get to understand the reason why it is happening so that they can go to their table and see whether if they can take a decision whether to stop or still continue now subscribe if this is your first time please subscribe to our channel because we have new updates you know on this issue for you guys now, subscribe hit the notification button and then like our videos like our videos and most of us watch our videos and then we don't like it but you know that we are giving you contents that most people are not giving truly fat truly fat when i look sometimes when i look at the views and i get discouraged i don't want to you know give more information but then it's just like a calling you have to just do it so we do it but then if you want to keep this thing running if you want to push the algorithm if you want to push you know give us the motivation then please subscribe to our videos and then like and share to your friends as much as you can yeah so that is it that is all that i have for you guys if you want to learn many importation if you want someone who will teach you many importation well who will give you a lifetime mentorship i am your plug just hit me up in the comment section and then i'll take your details then you'll be my lifetime mentee and believe you me when it comes to once it's eight eight i'm the best i'm the best i'll teach you everything that you got to know even when it comes to pin your deal i'll teach you everything that you need to know so take my number out there and then hit me up and let's learn together kudos